So, Pidgey, I hear that you were a test subject too. Yes, I was. I rather regret having ever taken the job. Me too? I don't think I'm ever going to be the same again. I'm always going to drool when I hear a bell. Speak for yourself. At least you had paved love. I was stuck with Skinner. Now every time I see a flashing button, I have to pick it. How does it work? He stuck me in this thing called a Skinner box and rewarded me with food every time I pecked the light. Pretty soon I was pecking it non-stop, but he only gave me the food some of the time. Wow, that seems mean. Apparently, it was to demonstrate how intermittent reinforcement created the greatest resistance to extinction. What about you? When I was given food as an unconditioned stimulus, I drooled, which was the unconditioned response. Then, Pave Love started ringing a bell before he gave me the food. At first this was just a neutral stimulus that didn't affect me, but soon I realized that the bell meant food was coming, so I started to drool in anticipation. At that point, the bell became a conditioned stimulus and my drooling became the conditioned response. It was classical conditioning, which is a form of learning where two unconnected stimuli are linked. Oh, mine was operant conditioning. That is a form of learning where a behavior and its consequence, negative or positive, are linked. I do have one question, though. I thought Skinner worked with pigeons, not turkeys. Um, is evolution a viable answer?